I'm Your Guy, the second book in the Hockey Guys series by Serena Bowen, is a contemporary romance novel that delves into the lives of professional athletes and the complexities of their personal relationships. Our main characters are Mark Bressler, a successful hockey player at the peak of his career, and a nutritionist named Haley Taylor Emery. Haley is not only well-versed in her professional field, but also co-owns a virtual assistant company called Fetch. Their paths cross unexpectedly when Haley's company is contracted to assist Mark. Mark Bressler has recently been named captain of his team, acknowledging his outstanding abilities on the ice. However, he's not only admired for his professional skills, but also for his striking good looks and charm, which have won him a large fan base. Mark is fully committed to his very demanding sport, which leaves him little time for personal relationships. Haley Taylor Emery's life is complicated in its own regard. She has found herself in the aftermath of a divorce, making efforts to move forward both personally and professionally. An ardent hockey fan since childhood, Haley has followed Mark's career with enthusiasm, so when the opportunity to work for him arises, she's both thrilled and nervous. Surprisingly, Mark has no idea that he is about to get help from Fetch. His well-meaning but intrusive family, concerned about his focus on hockey to the detriment of his personal life, set up the contract for him without his knowledge. They want to ensure he has more balance, worrying that he may be neglecting his health and everyday responsibilities. When Haley begins to work for Mark, their first encounters are less than ideal. Mark, unimpressed and skeptical of the need for a virtual assistant, initially focuses on the unnecessary intrusion into his set ways. Haley, on the other hand, is determined to prove her value. She begins by taking on the mundane tasks that Mark has been neglecting from stocking his fridge with the right foods to managing his schedule meticulously. Despite his resistance, Haley's competence gradually starts to break down Mark's barriers. As Haley becomes more integrated into Mark's life, their professional relationship slowly shifts into something more personal. They share a love for hockey, and this common passion fuels their conversations, allowing them to connect on a deeper level. Mark begins to see Haley not just as an assistant who makes his life easier, but as someone he enjoys being around. His initial skepticism fades as he starts to trust and rely on her. The tension between them intensifies, leading them to acknowledge the chemistry they can no longer ignore. However, the progression of their relationship is not smooth. Mark's dedication to his career means that he often places it before everything else, including Haley at times. This, along with the fact that Haley is still hurt from her recent divorce and cautious about entering a new relationship, hinders their budding romance. As they navigate these challenges, Mark and Haley struggle to find a balance between their professional and personal lives. While they are drawn to each other, they are also bound by the professional nature of their initial agreement. This creates a push-and-pull dynamic that tests the strength of their feelings. During the course of the story, Mark is faced with an injury that threatens not just his season, but his entire career. His vulnerability brings him and Haley closer together, as she supports him through his rehabilitation. This experience shifts Mark's perspective, making him realize that there's more to life than hockey, and that he can open up to the possibility of love. Haley, meanwhile, is gaining confidence and strength. She starts to prioritize her own happiness and well-being, which allows her to be more open to the potential of her relationship with Mark. Her nurturing nature and professional expertise are instrumental in Mark's recovery, and she becomes an anchor for him during this tumultuous time. Throughout the novel, the pair must confront external pressures that come with being in the public eye. The scrutiny of the media and the expectations of fans play a significant role in their lives, forcing them to consider the impact of their relationship on their respective careers. As they grow closer, they face significant hurdles, including distrust, miscommunication, and the impact of past experiences on their ability to commit to each other fully. They both must confront their insecurities and fears if they are to make their relationship work. In the end, Mark and Haley learn to compromise and communicate effectively, which allows them to emerge stronger as a couple. Mark's injury, once seen as a setback, 
becomes a turning point that enables him to prioritize his relationships over his career. He recognizes the value of having someone like Haley in his life, and they both realize that they are indeed perfect for each other. The conclusion of I'm Your Guy sees Mark and Haley finding a way to blend their personal and professional lives harmoniously. They embrace the idea that one can be committed to their career and still have a fulfilling and supportive relationship. Their love story is a testament to the power of patience, understanding, and the willingness to grow together. In classic Serena Bowen fashion, the novel combines humor, heat, and heartfelt moments, creating a captivating journey for readers. As the second installment in the Hockey Guys series, it offers another engaging look at the life of a professional athlete while exploring the complexities of love in the fast-paced world of sports. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.